You think it's more real for me to go slide for my brother or take her his kids and raise them up to That's be real. millionaires? That's real. What's real? Though? Second one. What's real? To raise them no, up and you, be. You know the. You I'm know what's real. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Even then, it's like, bro, I, it's I, just, I just think different. Like I told you, I used to argue with him about this. So, like, you ask, answer this question. You think it's more real for me to go slide for my brother or take her his kids and raise them up to That's be real. millionaires? That's real. What's real? Though? Second one. What's real? To raise them no, up and you, be. You know, the, you know what's real. Nigga, if you was a street and nigga killed you and you got kids, what you and you was in heaven, you can you can pick. Like, everybody for the die. Or my kids gonna raise up and be grown and, and successful and live the life that I was chasing. For your kids? You know, for, the, for the kids, bro. I did. But why people always end up doing all that crazy stuff, sliding and stuff like that, is because you get it's, caught in that moment of it's anger. Cause, it's because what these people tell them. It's because it's cause a motherfucker can make you feel like you're supposed to do that. Not knowing, they not, I don't, I don't know, I done been through some shit out of my life. I know niggas sitting in there. Not knowing it, like, bro, if I do go slide, if a nigga do go slide, now my brother's kids need to get took care of. My kids need to get took care of. If I go to jail, I need to be good to took care of. And the only person that's going to do that is my mama. Mm. Yeah. She ain't for to go slide. Yeah. <laughs> like, for real. So what you talking about, like, it's, it's it depends on where you come from and what you come under. Like, mm. I come under some real niggas who really living like that, like really doing that, but they done made it to get old and to tell you, like, man, go on all these niggas ain't going to, your ass going to go to jail. I was just did 20 years, ain't nobody called me. And that's the mm-hmm. niggas I slid for, like. You know, that's different, but like, you know, I'm my brother's keeper for sure. Yeah. And the funny thing, a lot of people know that because we hear people say all that all the time, but they still do crazy stuff. Why? It's it's, it's society. It's, it's uh, come, like I keep saying, like, it come from, that's why I'm, I'm trying to put something different. I'm really trying to put something different because I ain't trying to be like a preacher who's no, who's like, you know how niggas be preaching, but I ain't living like what they preaching. I ain't trying to do that. I'm just trying to get on some shit like what I'm saying. All that crazy shit come from how I look. Like if a nigga if a nigga wasn't sliding and the internet didn't care about who was sliding and what was, it wouldn't be talked about. The fact that if you don't slide, you ain't no gangster, or if you don't slide, you a hoe, or if you don't do this, you a hoe. Like niggas do that. Niggas don't want to get beat up on camera because they don't want to look like that. Niggas dying because they don't want to look like no hoe. Cause how I look. At the end of the day, it all boils down to how you looking. You know what I'm saying? But if you really on some gangster time, you sliding about that. If you really think like if you the, I'm gonna take care of the kids. You can't do both. You can't do all three for real. You gotta, you gotta do something. And that's when everybody come to play. And that's why I say I don't fuck with niggas. I don't trust niggas because like, you know, three one of them. Like if it was anybody else, three head first out here. So it's like, I see that. Like what I look like for real. Like I, my niggas, my niggas. Like and we we gonna do whatever for each other. Let me ask like, you this. I, I don't care about it. I went down to <clears throat> New Orleans. A few weeks ago, caught the documentary that came out on Soldier Slim, yeah. and uh, I, I I went and interviewed those guys. I interviewed the uh, the uh, sister, sister, the the yeah. son. He come here, yeah. and me and him real cool. Yeah. Um, and they had some different things they felt about Latham and and what happened on their episode. I just want to ask you, how did you feel about your you guys' episode the documentary. And, and the documentary, and, and and did you feel like it was everything you thought it would be? Nah, it ain't what I thought it was gonna be. I'm gonna say that, and then for two, I'm gonna say it was good for my mom and them. I liked it, and for three, I'm gonna just say you know, I it was cool, but it ain't, I I fuck with it. It was cool. I won't watch it again though. That's it. Were like, you able to see it before it actually came out to the air? And just kind of, I kind of knew what was gonna happen, but like. But it didn't show you the documentary before it came out. That's what, what did I'm you thinking. not like about it? You gotta say. I just don't like how they. They ain't really take care of who they put on there. So they picked some of the wrong people to put on there? They ain't picked the wrong people. They just could have picked better people, if that makes sense. Like, you're going to tell a story, like, you know, at least you know, at least make it make sense. But, like, I don't know. I don't want to be on there. Who did they I'm leave off? To, huh? Who did? Who did? Who, who would you who like did? to see on there? That, yeah, that, there's nothing wrong with saying it ain't no, it ain't, no, it, ain't no, it ain't no Pacific person. All I'm saying is I don't know if y'all tapped into the, to the Mo3 story, if y'all know how far the story go back. All I'm saying is Sean Cotton could have been on it. You know what I'm saying? Real life could have been on it. Like, it's just people like that that's like, they really, prophecy could have been on it. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's, they, that's, that's they really, had that. I, I that's why I said that. they did right. But it's just, you know, some people could have swapped out with some real people that could have gave y'all. More. You know, but it's like, it's TV and I understand. That's the thing. Like, I ain't tripping for real because I, I understand what they was on. 
Like, but it's just me personally. I ain't promoting it. Like, here you ever gonna do this? Because I know, like, if I put my stamp on it, I'm saying it's true. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.